Hello and welcome to Kalefi video where today we're going to discuss the 200 series thermostatic radiator valve head. Let's firstly take a look at why we use thermostatic radiator valves. Thermostatic valves are typically used for regulating the water flow to the radiators of central heating systems. The thermostatic radiator valve head contains an element with a special liquid which expands or contracts with the surrounding temperature. This plug is connected to a pin which in turn is connected to the valve head. The valve gradually closes as the temperature of the surrounding area increases, limiting the amount of hot water entering the radiator. This allows a maximum temperature to be set for each room. The thermostatic head controls the flow rate inside of the radiator. Because of this, the supplied water is always at the minimum quantity required and the delta T or temperature differential between the flow and the return will be the opposite as high as possible, increasing boiler or HRU efficiency. As the valve works, by sensing the temperature of the air surrounding it, it is important to ensure this is not covered by materials such as curtains or other items that could impact on the airflow. If the control is removed from the valve, the valve will be open and the radiator will always be hot. The thermostatic controller has a zero setting which prevents flow, but when positive isolation is required, a manual cap must be used. The frost setting also prevents the radiator and pipe work from freezing and causing damage from flooding to floors, coverings and structural items. It must be noted for the frost setting to operate, the heating system must be switched on. To set the valve to the desired temperature, simply rotate the head clockwise and anti-clockwise between the range of 0 and V or 0 and 5 as required. These numbers correspond to a set temperature. 0 is 5 degrees and 5 is 28 degrees, but a normal comfort setting of 3 will give you approximately 20 degrees. Now let's take a look at the operational features of the 200 series thermostatic head. If you lower the locking ring and rotate to the desired set temperature, push the locking mechanism up against the head until it locks into place. The valve can now only be adjusted between zero and the desired position. The head can also be set to a single non-adjustable position. Lower the locking ring and rotate until the reset button is behind the indicator. Re-engage the locking ring, the valve can now not be adjusted. Important to take into account the following when installing the 200 series TRV. The thermostatic head should not be fitted in recesses, boxing, behind curtains, or be exposed directly to excessive heat as this may affect the valve's performance. In some situations, it may not be possible to install the thermostatic control head in the optimum position. For example, when the head interferes with the opening of a door. In these cases, by using the thermostatic control head with remote sensor, the external sensor guarantees a correct measurement of the room temperature. Thank you for watching our video today on the 200 series thermostatic radiator valve head. I hope you enjoyed it. For more information on any of our products, please visit our website at www.kalefi.com or alternatively, visit our YouTube channel for more videos. Thank you for watching.